Hi, I'm Bethany Wallace, Content Manager for College Recruiter. At College Recruiter, we believe every student and recent grad deserves a great career. We create a quality candidate and recruiter experience. Our interactive media solutions connect students and grads to great careers. I'm here today with the Workplace Group. In addition to their recruitment, outsourcing, and project-based hiring services, they have a specific expertise in college recruitment. I'm joined by experts, Dr. Steven Lindner, Executive Partner, and Dr. Dominiki Dimitriadu, Partner and Director of Assessment Services, to discuss insights on college recruitment experiences. Steve and Dominiki, welcome. Hi, Bethany. Hi, Bethany. Good to be here. Right now, we're going to be talking about determining the return on investment of college recruiting. So what are the ways to best determine the return of investment on college recruiting? There are some other objectives that we often have, you know, and, and I love this example that, that we, we've used many times, and I think it resonates well with people. Is, and it's real. <laughs> and it's real. And it, it's, it's true. If you spent $5,000 to hire one person, from a university, and 24 months later, they end up discovering something that's patentable, that ends up leading you to uh, some new product or services. That has tremendous value to your organization. And you might say, gee, that cost per hire cost me 5,000, and I did these other 10, and they each cost me 500. I, I think you would agree that the one person that cost 5,000 was a much better return on your investment. So again, return on investment has this, this bigger concept and to really, to really get down to your return on investment, you need to look at all of the objectives you might have set for your program. So some of these might be current measures, it might be based on the 12 month, but usually we have to look way beyond uh, a one year cycle to really understand this. Thanks guys so much for your insights on determining the ROI of college recruiting. For more information, you can visit the Workplace Group at www.workplacegroup.com. You can also read our blog at collegerecruiter.com and follow us on Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, and YouTube.